Hey guys, and welcome to Sky Factory 3, episode 17. As promised, we will be building a wither spawner to get those lovely nether stars. So let's jump into it. I've also made a few little changes around the base. One you may notice as soon as we log in. I've um, I've changed my nether portal. Um, it's no longer a nether portal. Um, it's using some lovely, lovely stuff from Draconic Evolution. It still works like the nether portal, but it's not one. It's a lot faster. Uh, I've also added this here. Now, if you remember the nether portals, obviously they all take you to the same place. This one, not so much. I've made this lovely, very basic platform and I've moved all of my processing stuff here. Now, reason for doing that is these annoying machines, although we need them, they are causing some lag issues. So I've moved them very far away from the base. So I don't actually render them when I'm playing. So frames generally are quite good. I've moved the solar panels here as well. Um, and potentially I may actually move the ore mining over here as well uh, going forward. So yeah, it's kind of awesome. It's instantaneous travel, which is kind of cool. Um, not much else has changed. I've added a few more seeds uh, to, I don't know where I'm going there. I can actually show you on here. So, new seeds we got the guardian essence which can make fish and stuff like that uh we got the elorium because going forward when we complete one of the challenges which i actually need to set up and we should go through and take some stuff off at some point um we're gonna need a lot of elorium got some ghast essence don't really need a lot of this stuff cow essence chicken essence blaze essence uh, pig essence so yeah it's uh it's a few things that have been been added so yeah these uh these top two floors are now completely empty uh it took a, a few hours to tear it all down and rebuild it all and to be fair it was kind of enjoyable so yeah that's uh everything's all still hooked up to this our output has definitely increased but as I said, I'm not worried. We, we, we're we holding 2 billion RF in this thing. And we're generating 50,000 RF from the... Uh, from the solar panels. So, uh, I don't think I changed anything downstairs. I've moved that. That's there now. Um, I've just got simple teleporters, elevators here. Could have used that really, shouldn't I? Um, oh, I've just added a, a few more of these. Yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Um, as I said, nothing else has really changed. But yeah, so let's uh, let's teach this lovely, lovely little computer how to um, make some wither proof proof. Can't pronounce my ths with a proof uh, with a proof glass. Uh, is it that one or that one? We'll go for that one. So I think we're going to need a couple of stacks of this for my little plan. Uh, oh no, we've just done that. There's that one there. Do five stacks. That's probably overkill, but hey ho. Um, Something I will want to do is set up another one of those at some point. Hmm. Yeah, maybe. Well, I haven't quite decided where I want this yet. I'm feeling that we could keep it away from the base, just so if one does escape, don't need to worry too much. Um, I will take some network stuff with me so we can actually have an RF system out there uh, some 
combo is yep uh what else do we need we need some like cool auto places yeah some oh, okay so we've got to teach this recipe as well uh oh the atomic reconstructor okay let's build that why okay i'm getting some server lag lovely lovely uh where were we that one wasn't it atomic reconstructor uh this is enough don't know why i'm auto crafting that doesn't really need it Oh, and apparently you already have one. Oh, yes, I had one on the uh, the original wooden island. I remember now. Um, actually, let's go to our new new bit, our processing place, and we'll set this up over here. I feel it's probably better. Um, Yeah, so that can go there. Get some conduit. Go there. Hmm. You know what? We're in the age of wireless. Let's go wireless. That's just coming off of that. Uh, flux. What I'm going to do is ignore limit because this thing tends to fire rather slow. That was a button. Oh, nice. Okay. Cool, so just put our items there. Uh, so what do we need for that auto placer? Uh, the palace crystal and uh, lapis. Okay, we got plenty of lapis. No, that is not what I wanted. I want that one. We'll do a couple of stacks of this, I think. Nice. I transformed all of that. Remember when we were doing that last time? It, it, you have to press it like 20,000 times just for anything to happen. Um, what else do we need for this one? Restonia, which. Redstone. I'll put that in there. Some more redstone. No, don't pick it up. Wow. So much better. Okay, so... I think that's pretty much it, isn't it? Auto placer, so yeah, it's just cobble. And these things fairly easy let's go back home okay so yeah we've got all of our stuff in there we need a couple of these so might as well create a little template um we got them as that Okay, so that's that one. And there's that one. I might. Hmm. I wonder. I'll test something out later, and then if it works, good, cool. We'll show you. If not, not to worry. Uh, Lisa. 
Uh, we're going to need, what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of these. Um, conduits, we're going to need some redstone. Oh, let's create some more of that. Um, I need a lever. What a way to turn this on and off. Yep. And we're going to need a timer. And we're also going to need. I can't remember what it's called, but it's what delays the ticks of redstone pulses. Um, where are you? Are you in this bit? See it anywhere. Just don't torch. Um, I swear I've got them the auto crafting. I mean, we could just work off of two separate redstone signals, but that's not comparator. Ah, repeater. That's the one I want. Yeah, so you can delay redstone signals with this if memory serves. I'm thinking it's the right. Yeah. Cool. So let's. Let's go out this way. Uh, let's go out a fair few blocks. One angel block. you cool so let's go up one two three four five six seven eight blocks from there and then we'll start building this thing So make it what five by five, I think. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And what we'll do is we'll leave a gap so we can smash his face in. first couple of times until we can get the the wither killer cool all right so go up one two three four five six seven Run out of glass. Oh my god. Okay. That's fine. Uh, actually, I want to make sure. Is that the one? That's not the one. That's the one I wanted. Make sure we're actually in a single chunk as well so we can. Uh, nom, nice. nom, 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 nom. 
What the hell was that? <laughs> that was so freaky. <laughs> that actually made me jump. Okay. <laughs> wow. Let's put our um, transmitter receiver and our up there. Okay, let's actually mark this, shall we? Uh, we call it wither so we can find it again in a minute and then it, it eventually we'll set up a, a portal. Um, so we can get back and forth nice, quick and easy. Uh, find. Cool. Right, I'm gonna head back to base and set this up so I can. Um, yeah, so we can carry on. There we go. And yeah, we want that one. Yeah, set this up. Hopefully, I've done this the right way around. Yes. 564 blocks. Ooh. Went up significantly. Right, 11. Between 11.5 and 11. Seven. Right, let's put this back in. Twelve four. Oh my goodness, that's using a lot. Oh well. Uh, something we do want is crafting grid out there. I don't think I actually made one, did I? No. Cool. All right, I'm gonna head back out there. Cool. Right, so uh, crafting grid can go there. We can add access to all of our stuff. What I'm gonna do as well, actually. Let's set one of these up because oh, why not? Uh, range extender, a range upgrade. Cool. And we want some of that glass, don't we? I will create some more. I don't think we're going to need that much more, but I'll create some more nonetheless. Um, okay, so we don't need the cobble anymore, don't need that. Something I will do, keep this chunk loaded. And oh, torches, because I don't want any other mobs down here. Uh, F7. Get rid of you. Cool. And right, okay, so where's our little crafters? What they called placers, aren't they? Did I pick them up? Oh, I did pick them up. Cool. Good memory. <laughs> so we want one there. And they're all going to be facing the wrong way. Cool. Where's our bench? There it is. How do I turn this round? Oh, I've literally got to place it the way I want it to face. Oh, that's irritating. Okay, we can do that. If I could see what I was doing be nice. Uh, 
Oh no, I've just messed that up. Stay flying. Oh my goodness. There we go. I'll get there eventually. Just me being a noob. It's very difficult in the dark. Okay, so that's it. And then we got one more. We nearly run out of glass. gap in this for the minute so I'll get in and out nice and easy cool uh, we're gonna need a little platform out I need to place that I need a little platform out here and get rid of the glass for the minute so we can work I think that should be good Now we're also going to need, what are we going to need? We're going to need some conduit, we're going to need some item conduits, which we've got, redstone conduit, we don't need that conduit, cool, so let's do the redstone one first because it's a pain in the backside. Um, Four, five, six, seven, whatever. Cool. So we want the top ones on black. I can find it. There it is. Oh, I didn't do that one. Black, it's just back one. Nice, okay. And then these, where's brown? And it's for two. Okay, so that is that. Yeah, so we're gonna need two separate redstone signals. I'm gonna need another timer. Okay, let's go down the bottom and make another one. Some light up here as well. Come on, there we go. Clock. Or whatever that is. Yeah, it's a clock. Cool, so we got two. Okay, so off of that, we're going to need to put these. So this one's going to be insert on black. Actually, let's make life easier. Where's our probe? You are. Copy, paste, and paste. That was done right. Yeah. Uh, insert on brown. Copy. Paste. Paste. And paste. Cool. So all those should be the same. Bring that down. Split there and there. 
we'll have two crates. That didn't quite work, did it? Okay, no, they're there. And we will extract. Top one is black, bottom one's brown. Black, round robin. Robin Brown. Uh, we'll always have these active. That's kind of cool. And redstone. We we'll need to expand. It doesn't need to actually be that far out, does it? Cool, timer. A new round. I think it's 2000 delay for the time being. Is this actually doing anything? So, color. The that one we want brown. Don't know if they animate or not. Let's put that in there and see what happens. Okay, so that's working. So that's kind of cool. too much of an issue. And then we want this one. Oh. There you want. There's some more cobble. And a wand. There you go. I'm hoping... So 20 ticks is one second. Uh, Twenty ticks is one second. Okay, so we want this one to be more frequent than the other one. So if we do 60 on that one. Then we do 120 on that one. That's three and six seconds. Which should be good. Oh, you know what I'm going to have to do, don't you? I'm going to have to move that up top. It's not too much of a big deal, I suppose. Expand this way as well. And we get all of our stuff. to get this working again we're gonna to have to go back to the base uh, where is it there it is. cool and then yeah okay all right so I'm gonna get this working again and then I'll be back in a second 
Okay, cool. So this is all set back up again, and I was uh, having a little play with this, and I've uh, changed some things down here. So if we do actually want to turn this off, we can. Um, something I did notice: these were on deactivation. We want them on pulse. Uh, you take a redstone torch and you just right-click on them, and turn them over to pulse. That way, they're controlled by the redstone, um, and they will then output when they're told to, basically. Now, with the um, soul sand, we want that out so quick, but well, I say so quick, we, we need time for the wither to spawn, drop down, and then it can then build the, the next lot of soul sand. But after that, you then have to wait for the wither skull heads to be put on place we can't have the wither heads before the soul sand otherwise it just gets a bit messy now i don't know if there's any other sort of places or anything like that um i don't know what this phantom placer does so i can't really oh hello phantom breakers and places work similarly to the normal phantom faces except that they are used to break uh, to break blocks from a distance, their default range is three blocks to connect them to blah 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 blah. blah. So I'm not going to mess about with that, but there is, can't, I don't know the name of the block, uh, but there is a block you can. Oh, actually, it might be the mechanical user. There's this. Ah, no. Use item. Use item on block. Okay. All right, we're gonna swap, and you can use redstone with this, can't you? Redstone always on. Redstone on. Redstone off. Redstone pulse. Cool. Okay, we're gonna use these. Uh, mechanical user, and of course we don't have that. <laughs> well, come on. What am I missing? I'm missing the dropper, am I? Okay. There we go. So, I'll tell you what, yeah, we're going to use these. So, we're going to use these auto placers. Not too much of an issue. But then we'll just swap these other ones out for mechanical users. That way, we set it up for um, use item on block, use item on block, and we want to uh, right click, yes, random slot. I think that's right. We'll test it out, we'll see how it goes. That way, there, there will never be an, inc um, uh, an instance where it gets messed up. So, uh, where were we? Let's set the rest of this up. Let's get some exporters. No, I want an exporter on you. On you and cable. Just run it around the outside of this little platform. Not too much of an issue. Now, I don't obviously want to create a wither just yet. Pull this in there. Uh, wrench back out. Skull. So this one is black, so that's for the skulls. It's brown for soul sand. See stack upgrades. 
get some speed upgrades. So fingers crossed this works. Let me um let me go get my my sword so we can kill this guy when he spawns. Okay, so I've got my sword. Let's put this down. There we go. So he's spawned. Nice. And let's put another lot up there. Awesome. So wait for him to explode. And then if we can get him, oh my goodness. To a place near me, please. Go round and round the circles. Nice. So that should spawn them without any issues whatsoever. Let's just seal this up. And okay, so let's also get a collector. And uh, chest when stuff does drop, picks it up automatically. There we go, and we'll set that it's absolutely everywhere so we're never going to miss anything. <clears throat> cool. Okay, so that is our wither spawner. Let's let's go kill another one, shall we? Actually, let's spawn a couple just to make sure it works. All right. There's one, Aurelian. F. And Ryan the Almighty. Right, let's stop that spawning. And we have three to kill. Nice. Gonna be a pain in the butt as well. So we can get the Draconic mob uh, killer thing. It's like instant death for these guys. Well, oh, should I put an XP collector down here as well? Can't let that precious XP go to waste. Plus, if it's not collected, it'll end up lagging the server. You nearly did. Bye bye. Come on, Hef. There we go. Nice, so that is our Wither Spawner. Nice working, fairly simple setup to be fair, and automated. And works like a 
charm. Sweet. Well, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.